Today is a uh, show. Okay, guys. Today is September 20th, 2024, Canada, baby, and it is 8.47 a.m. Eastern Time, and I got stuff to do, okay, guys, and, uh, trying to do. Email and your phone number, and, uh, nobody calls back, you know what I'm saying, guys? And right into it, uh, Tent City Weather Report, okay, guys? Uh, it's supposed to be, uh, warm over the weekend, uh, I think by, I think by the end of the weekend, you're gonna need the old, uh, umbrella, okay, guys? We don't know because when you watch the weather even, okay, it's here, there, everywhere, and uh, before you know it, uh, your region has, uh, you know, poof, gone. And you could do your research, okay? All right. I'm right into it. I wasn't going to hop on today, okay, but uh, here I am, baby. Here I am, okay? The chicken scratch notes that I want to go over, but uh, I'm going to have to get to that another time, okay? Two big things I want to talk about that are on the old uh, chicken scratch notes, okay? All right. World War III has been brought up quite a bit, okay, guys? It was actually brought up in the House of Commons the other day. I don't know what day it was. I want to say it was Monday, Tuesday, what, maybe Wednesday? Oh, that's when Trudeau made the uh, big boy chair comment. Because he thought that Pierre couldn't sit in the big boy chair. Well, you know what, uh, Trudeau? Anybody could sit in the big boy chair. Uh, big boy chair, I think, was the news flash day. Anyways, Trudeau brought up World War III the other day in the House of Commons. Candace Owens has been talking about World War III, too. Check out Candace Owens, okay? If you ask me, okay, it is the Western side, us guys, that are causing all the overseas, okay? Back when the Freedom Convoy rolled into Ottawa, okay, that's when uh, the whole Russian aggression started in uh, Ukraine, right? Ukraine, and we know why we know Christian Freeland is also Ukrainian and, uh, you know, uh, sent a whole bunch of our money to you, Ukraine. I don't know, I'm just some YouTuber, maybe conspiracy theorist, but uh, right around everyone came to Ottawa, that's when this whole Russian war started, and it appears to me, appears to me that uh, maybe the Canadian government was trying to dodge. Right? That's done, big boy chair, World War Three. game come soon. I just posted 39 minutes ago, uh, Mark Miller, your immigration minister, okay, Basically called Right Bland and Chris Daisy uh, racists, okay? Because they were questioning the uh, immigration system, okay? Da, 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 da. I had said uh, the other day, white guys can't say in Canada, right? Without being called a racist, right? Right. Oh, man. Okay, I posted the village people because um, Jaggy uh, showed some real aggression. Okay, we got Russian aggression, but we got Jaggy aggression, too. That video where Jaggy saying really sh displayed his real colors. Okay, the guy in the background had said about Russia and World War Three. Okay, all right, there goes Jaggy and his uh, tricycle built for ice cream. It looks like an ice cream... Truck. I remember when I was a kid, uh, I used to wait when i go to the big city and wait for the Dickie D ice cream. That's what that reminds me of. Oh, okay, here we go. We gotta check this out, okay? I had no words yesterday, guys. Get the fuck out of this city, bro. Get me out of here. Get me out of here. I'm getting tickets for noise out of my car because the speakers and motherfuckers are driving around. Driving around! With fucking this. Ontario Brapton. Brap. He's Brapton. Can't see it very well. What? Sam, come on. Bud, get me the, out of this country, man. But where do you go? Because it's like, uh, it seems to be like this everywhere. Oh, complete chaos in the House of Commons, okay? Uh, because uh, Jaggy won't answer the question why he's not. He says he pulled out of the coalition, but he's uh, not going to vote against Trudeau if there was like this con. No confidence in Trudeau, okay, Jaggy? And I said, what you missed on The Young and the Restless, Pierre Polyov, still fighting for Canadians after several scandals. Speaker Fergus kind of started doing his job. And you're right, Fergie, Canadians are watching. We are, Fergus. Jagmeet Singh says he did, but hasn't yet. Make up your mind, Nikki. Hashtag pull out Singh. You had to use hashtag pull out Singh again if you had have really pulled out the first time, Jaggy. Oh, okay, this was a gooder, and I just started discovering this six buzz, okay? 
And I've looked them up and they are posting what is actually going on, what I have seen, what I've posted myself, okay? And there was a homeless man in Calgary sleeping behind the paper towels in the superstore. Lynn, our Facebook friend, said, kick him. And I said, uh, you know, uh, clean up on aisle five. Yesterday was Tamara Litch's birthday and she was uh, one of the big... Uh, one of the big people involved in the Freedom Convoy and her intentions were good and not once did she encourage any sort of um, uh, rhetoric and, uh, you know, um, uh, chaos. She just promoted love and, uh, you know, freedom, okay? Because I watched that during my recovery because I had nothing else to do. Tamara Litch, she can rock on. Check her out. Boy, boy, even more impressive. Okay. Uh, oh, Miranda Lambert had a new song. Okay. Um, Candace Owens. Okay. Um, her and another guy were talking about why is everybody on this bandwagon uh, about Kamala Harris, especially guys. Okay. And they're like, it's kind of gay that all these guys are like, oh, I like Kamala Harris. Right. Uh, and you know what? That's when you got to laugh at yourself. Right, guys. And uh, I do think it's kind of. All right, and then Candace Owens, okay, talks about the many accents of Kamala Harris. And I just posted this last week of Sky News Australia that laughed at Kamala Harris because she broke out about three different accents in the course of, like, days. The leadership event that was today, I just want you to hear this little accent. Oh, it's good to see so many friends. Um, I love you back. <laughs> I love you back. <laughs> it's so hard, you know me, I come from a country that I love you back. Te amo mucho. So soy Candice, you can call me Candice. I want to run because I want to do this. I think it would be... I love me some Candice Owens. Okay. Because we're not getting what's going on. Like the CNN and all that kind of stuff, they're censored too, guys. Okay, it's quite obvious. Okay, and... This one uh, was from Michelle Ferrari from the House of Commons, okay? They're giving kids drugs, okay? Uh, kids are getting drugs for treatment and dying in Canada. Check that out. And I said, are you still liberal yet? For sakes. Oh, okay. And you might want to do the dishes, okay, guys? Because we had a special perv alert. And I tag John Walsh, as I always do when there is a uh, perverts, okay? Food delivery person arrested for sexual assault at apartment, okay? It, honestly, guys, um, start shopping local, okay? Start shopping local. When Christmas is coming, find something local so you don't have these guys finding out where you live and then they come in and they sexually assault you. And I saw the other day knitted socks for $10 and I thought, wow, that's going to be a great Christmas present along with uh, when I get my hands on some Axe Attacks bumper stickers. That's what people are getting because you can't afford in Canada. So find ways to shop local, okay? So you don't get sexually assaulted at your door. Okay, and then I found this out from Anna Roberts, who is another amazing female in uh, the Conservative Party. Um, the man arrested after allegedly sexually assaulting three women at York U campus. Wow. Jamil Giovanni in uh, Durham, uh, he spoke out about the broken uh, immigration system, okay? Uh, check out Jamil Giovanni. You go, Jamil. He just got in last uh, winter, I guess, and he's doing a bang-up job. Oh, and then this was Trudeau on his way into uh, Parliament, and he had somebody in front of him taping him, and I said, uh, how did Justin Trudeau graduate acting school? Okay, because we've all seen those crocodile tears too, right, guys? Seen a guy cry as much as Trudeau, okay? Fake tears, though, fake tears. Uh, and then I posted the news flash thing where Trudeau said news flash, news flash, news flash, and I just happened to mention news flash a couple times. So news flash, Trudeau, and uh, Speaker Fergus, I'm watching. Stay true. Uh, get to talk in and uh, have a beautiful weekend, okay? And uh, try to make sure that uh, that the girls don't get fondled this weekend. You know what I'm saying?